Use I forgot my pin. Step 1. Type settings in search bar, then hit enter. Step 2. Navigate to accounts, look to the left and click on sign in options. Step 3. Select Windows, Hello Pin. Step 4. Navigate to I Forgot My Pin option. Click Continue and follow the on-screen instructions. Step 5. Enter your Microsoft account's password. Next, you can choose between two options, setting a new pin or using an old pin. Make up your mind. Then go back to the sign-in option and determine whether the issue persists. Delete NGC folder and add a new pin. Step 1. Press Windows plus E to open File Explorer, then navigate to the following path. C. And Windows or Service Profiles, Local Service IAP.I, Local or Microsoft or NGC. Step 2. Open NGC folder. Highlight all the content and press Delete. Step 3. Press Windows plus I to open settings. Step 4. Navigate to Accounts and click on the Sign-in option. Step 5. Select Windows Hello Pin. Step 6. Choose Add to add the new pin. Step 7. Enter your Microsoft account's password and click OK. Step 8. In the new window, Enter a four-digit PIN and enter the same PIN in the nearby box. Step 9. Close setting, restart your device, and see how things turn out. Take advantage of Registry Editor. Note. It's a good idea to create a backup of files and folders before applying changes in Registry Editor. Step 1. Press Windows plus R to open the Run dialog box. Step 2. Type Regedit and click OK to open Registry Editor. Step 3. Navigate to the following path, HKA Local Machine Software, Policies, e Microsoft Windows Assistant. Step 4. Locate a file named Allow Domain Pin Logon. If you cannot see such a file, right-click on the empty white space, click New Dward, 32-bit, value, and rename the file to Allow Domain Pin Logon. Step 5. Double-click on the named file, set the value to 1, and close the registry editor. Last but not least, restart your computer. Create a new administrator account. Step 1. Press Windows plus I to open settings. Step 2. Navigate to Accounts Family and Other Users. Add someone else to this PC. Step 3. Click on I don't have this person's sign-in information. Step 4. Then click Add a user without a Microsoft account. Step 5. Enter a username, set a new password and confirm it. Step 6. Click Next to complete the process. Step 7. Log out of the current account and log in into the newly created account. Step 8. Press Windows plus I to open settings. Go to Accounts and click Sign-in options. Step 9. Select Windows, Hello Pin and choose Add to add the new pin. Step 10. On the Windows Security Prompt, enter your Microsoft account's password and click 
OK Step 11. Enter the four-digit PIN and confirm it by clicking. OK Step 12. Restart your device. Perform a Windows Reset. All in all, a Windows Reset reverts your device settings back to Windows default settings, and that should put an end to many errors. To perform a Windows Reset, you need to go to Settings, Update and Security, Recovery, Reset this PC, then click Get Started.